Well, my friends, welcome back to a Music Monday, and I hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys had a great weekend. And so for this video, I might have to replace my camera. Stop it. Or see if there's an update of some kind. But anyway, oh, it's fine. It does fine for the most part as long as I'm not animated. I'm going to be animated with my voice and my non-face. I'm just going to, ah, you know, just do that. Where you could kind of hear more emotion from my voice and you don't need to see it from my hands. Okay, anyway, I'm, I'm just joking. Uh, so anyway, for this Music Monday, uh, this is a long time coming. David, I'm sorry. I've been meaning to react to this song. But the past couple of weeks, a lot of good songs have come out. That Well, not good songs, but songs that I wanted to like check out. And yeah, but David, it's happening. And I'm excited to check out. With from my friends Waves in Autumn, Winter Gaze featuring Azakari. Azakari sounds familiar, but it might just be because it sounds close to uh, Andy Sizek's band. Makari, I believe, is his other band outside of Monuments. Yeah, there's a couple of bands that he has outside of like Termina, Monuments, and yeah, I think it's Makari. I think it's his other band. But it sounds similar. But anyway, yeah. So my friends in Waves and Autumn have checked out a three of their songs, I believe. And so this one, I enjoy the music. They're great at making music, and all it's usually fun. It's usually usually high energy, very punk vibes. The very which is funny, like from the very first song, the Gorilla song. I think it's called Gorilla. I could be wrong. Um, where it's all David screaming and more of just like a uh, I can't think of anything anymore. But anyway, it was like not as more punk vibes as the last two songs I've checked out. But we're going to see from this one, like David has a great voice. I like his screams, I like his cleans. And so we're going to check out like how this song goes. It's called Winter Gaze featuring Azakari. So I don't, yeah, might be interested to check out Azakari after this, but we'll see. I usually do, especially with like a lot of the LSD stuff. I sometimes check out uh, the artist that he collaborates with, but we'll see. It's like, if I like it, then I'm going to check it out. But anyway, David, it's for you and your band. Uh, hopefully you guys enjoy it as much as the other videos. And as always, I'm more likely going to enjoy you guys' music like I have. So let's get into it. Thank you guys for hanging out with me on this Music Monday and let's... Go into winter gaze. Okay. Nice. Already high energy. Like it. Like the mix of master. I know I can't really play some things. We're going for the best. Cowbell? It's like I'm going to someone. So you'll be lying on. I don't want to feel it. Nice. Nice transition there. Accented drum roll, snare roll, nice. Then he works well done. Nice little yeah. Got it. The like ghost note snares. Must be as a car. Him doing the chorus, nice.
like the perspective, like the camera perspective for Zazakari. Nice slow. Nice. There's a lot of feature, which is not, not wrong with that. It's just that yeah, you don't see it all the time. Oh, it just ends immediately. Nice. All right. So that was Waves in Autumn featuring Azakari. So yeah, yeah, for features wise, yeah, you don't see that a lot where they get a lot featured wise and so yeah he had a verse a chorus and then essentially after verse two and chorus two he essentially was a part of a lot of the harmony harmonizing or just like match up it's like whether you lyrically and everything like that which is cool like you don't see it it's like it's like two bands like making a song together but actually having like equal parts in it and i wonder if that's the case where as a also had a part in like the writing and everything like that which is cool to see. Yeah, it's really cool to see. I it's like I am always a person that loves collaborations. It's like Nick Nocturnal will always be a guy. LSD will always be a guy that I always treasure music from just because it's like I love just collaborating with different bands, different musicians, different ideas. And those guys doing stuff doing stuff like that will always do more for the music entirely. Well, I guess the industry as a whole. Just because of just bringing in other people who aren't from the same genre and bringing in other people that are from the same genre to get like different perspectives and everything like that. But song wise, yeah, high energy as always. Waves and Autumn, they don't they don't mess around with that energy. And it's so it's so great to always like kind of have like a hypeness surrounding it. And it's always fun. And yeah, great vocals. Uh, Azakari, I don't know a lot. I don't even know. Let's see. Let's check him out. One second. Because I don't know about anything as a stuff. Yeah, there they are. Nice. Also from Italy. That's cool. It makes sense, especially to like be featured and everything like that. Oh, good on them. They like make music and do stuff like that. I like that. It's always fun to see bands come together. Uh, I may have heard them randomly. It works out. No, fun. Kind of excited to check out some of their stuff and see, but we'll see. But anyway, let me know. As always, let me know what you guys think of Waves at Autumn. Like, really really cool band super excited i think i think david last said they have like an ep of sorts coming out or just more music um i don't know but nevertheless go go show them love go check out the rest of their songs also for azakari go check them out if you're like interested in like like the guy's vocals like has pretty good lows and singing wise it's quite different than david's so it's like that was probably the more adjusting part where it's like where he had like that verse and chorus it's like because like him and david have like different i want to say david's an octave higher it sounds like but this is just me kind of talking out of my butt now because i don't <laughs> i know similar stuff it's i know sub stuff but i Sometimes talk like I'm smarter than I really am, and especially in that in the music industry and everything like that. But it sounds like that to me. Like David has a he definitely has a higher pitch voice. Now whether it's an octave higher, he definitely has a higher pitch voice than the Azakari singer. But nevertheless, thank you guys for joining me on this music Monday. Let me know what you guys think of Ways in Autumn. It's like they're a band I've been checking out and probably will continue to check out, especially if they put out music that I like and music I enjoy and just Fun music just to, you know, this is great. They put out really great, like, exercise music, like high BPN and 
it's fun to just get out there and just like, I'm just going to go hard today and work out everything like that. So that's the main thing. But with that, let me know what you guys think. And I will see you guys in the next video for more likely our weekly Wednesday. And so, yeah, see you guys then. Be safe. Take care and have a good week until then. Well, and after then and during, you know, always have a good week is what I mean to say. <laughs> see you guys.